ano ni blueberries. Tiny ones. I think we let them grow for a little bit longer. We need rain to make them grow. See how dry it is. It's all yellow and brown. This is not normal. Is it warmer than normal where you live? You tell me in the comments. Mm -hmm. This is not normal. I'll insert a picture here to what a typical summer in Sweden would look like. This is what it would look like. It's green, it's alive. And now look at this. Look at this. This is not alive. This is not the Swedish summer I'm used to. Look at this poor little crusty leaf. That's not supposed to happen until, until fall. What is happening with nature? Pretty sunset though. <gasps> Who's a good boy? Who's the cutest baby? Why did I sound Irish? I'm sorry if that offends any Irish people. I'm really not that great at doing accents. It's fun though. What you doing? Oh, he's eating the grass. Oh yes, there's not a lot of green grass anymore. So you gotta work to get some. Work, 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 work. If I had a dollar for every time someone asked me if I eat grass, because I'm vegan. Grass and tofu. I hardly ever eat tofu. But for some reason, that's still what people seem to think. The most famous Swedish joke is, ah, oh, the Swedish summer is so wonderful. It's the best day of the year. As to say, there's one day of summer and the rest is not summer. And obviously it's exaggerated, but yeah, we have never had a summer like this, as far as I know, where it's been so warm blasting sun and no rain no rain at all it's usually green we have so much rain and that's one of my favorite parts with summer the rains and thunderstorms come on rain where are you we need it we actually have forest fires now i saw on the news that they're evacuating people from specific areas that's sad and scary and not something you'd expect from this country. 